Hey everybody, as you can see, I am no longer in Carthage. I am at my house. Oh god, look at all the mess. I got a bit of, I got a bit of work to do here. But I uh, have decided to go ahead and make a video to explain to you a couple of things. Oh, and there's the wind. Let's see if I can't get into this over here. I'm going to be moving back to my house here in, uh, in southeastern Missouri. And... I wanted to let you guys know. I've been kind of keeping it a secret since February, something like that. February. It's been a long time. But I wanted to make sure that I could finalize everything. And I wanted to make sure I had uh, kind of a date in line. I'm moving something there. I wanted to explain to everyone why I'm coming back home. Uh, the reason is has nothing to do with Vaughn and Randy at all. Nothing at all before anybody suggests that, oh, this roommate situation didn't work out, what did some, what they piss you off, what did you piss them off? No, nothing like that happened. We're lovely together, it's great. I love living with them. I lo actually really love Carthage. Uh, I like Joplin quite a bit because there's a mall there and I don't ever get to go to a mall. Uh, a lot of, uh, a lot of new things for me over there. But there also aren't any jobs, any more jobs there than there are here. So I called back to the park and I kind of already had already arranged it um, this last year, but anyway, I got a confirmation that I'm able to go back to the park here in southeast Missouri to work for the summer. Hopefully, I will get enough hours to apply for a permanent position some other time, maybe next year. I don't know. Uh, so uh, that's why I'm moving back. I'm moving back for work. It was actually the whole reason that I moved in the first place was for work. This year I'm not going to be doing interpretation like I have been the last couple years. I'm going to be a maintenance worker. Um, I could have applied for interpretation again. It wouldn't have made any difference, you know, one way or another. Probably would have got the job back because I've experienced at it already. But I decided to, we'll say, diversify and try something else. So I can still be a naturalist. I still intend on being a naturalist. I still intend on taking lots of video, doing lots of hikes. If I can, I would, um, I'd like to travel to other parks, and that might actually be a lot more feasible this year because I'm going to have a set schedule. The schedule is a little earlier, but I get out earlier. It's something like 7.30 in the morning to 4.30, something like that. So that means that I'll have more time to enjoy the summer, I guess, because yeah, otherwise I'm not going to be up in the morning. I'm not missing anything, <laughs> really. I don't get up at 6 in the morning normally. I, I'll get up at noon. That's why I'm moving back. That's why you're going to be seeing a lot more of uh, this horrible mess of a place <laughs> that I gotta I gotta do something with. I am still going to be raising rabbits. I got some chickens, the baby chicks right now, that are still in Carthage at the moment. I still got my dog. Got my two cats. I have a turkey. Uh, I'm going to be trying to do quail again. I have to wait and see if the uh, fella's going to have some eggs for me before I leave. I told him mid May or mid May. I told him mid April. So, I, I don't know exactly what he is um, planning to do. It's been really cold at night, and that usually means that the quail eggs aren't going to be viable, even though they're fertile. Oh, also, I have the beetles still. Yes, I do. I have not done a beetle update. I don't think I've done a beetle update since I got them <laughs> in December. But the colony's grown a lot, and they're able to, to do one rabbit skull in about four or five days, seven days. I'm kind of lazy and leave them in there for a little bit longer. Also... I'm not sure why, but I have something like 1,500 subscribers. It might be 1,600. I, I haven't had the internet for a few days. I have to go next door and use their wireless when uh, when I want the internet. So I've had limited internet for the last, since Saturday. It, it's awesome, and I don't really, it's, I'm kind of beside myself with it. I, don't, I never really expected it that that many people would give two shits about what I had to say about anything. But uh, I, the last time I did one, it was for 109 <laughs> subscribers, 106, 109, and I want to do another one for 1,500, 1,600, however many there are of you by the time this comes out, and uh, a Q&A is what I'm getting at. I want to do another Q&A, so if you have any questions for me, any suggestions, any, um, any whatever, any whatever at all, go ahead and leave them in the comments down below. But I think that's about it. In summary, coming back home probably in a couple weeks. Uh, still raising buddies, got some chickens, a turkey, I hope, is still alive. I might have quail. Birds chirping, but yeah. 
that's about it. Uh, Q and A. Make sure you leave them them uh, them questions. If you like what I do, if you like this video, if you like any of my videos, maybe not this one. I'm not good at vlogs, but if you like them, go ahead and hit the like button wherever that's at. What's it? Here? I don't know. I don't. I, I don't know what way my camera is facing when I do this. But the the hit the like button, and if you really like me, hit that subscribe if you haven't already. If uh, you love me super duper long time forever, you can go down into my description and click on that Patreon link also down there. There are also a few other things down there you can check out. I have my uh, Amazon affiliate link, which is another way that you can help support the channel if you don't want to use Patreon. Um, you can simply watch the ads if you want to watch the ads for 30 seconds, I believe. You can also check out my Etsy shop and my wish list and all of the other stuff down there. Now, on the other hand, if you're bored of me and you're sick of my shenanigans and my, my rambling on and stuttering and being not good at, at words, you can also go down the description and you can click that mystery link. It will take you to other part of YouTube. You're not going to be leaving the site. It's another video that could range anywhere from educational and nice and, and fun, or it can be some stupid, super stupid ass retarded crap that I found when I was drunk or tired at four in the morning. It could be anything. It's a mystery. So hit that. It's not really affiliated with anybody. I just find, literally just find random videos <laughs> and I post them down there. And what else? I think that's it. Most importantly, keep being amazing. And I would, I would ask you to keep watching my videos <laughs> and uh, keep, keep letting me know that you like what I do, even if it's just with a view. I will see you next time. Thank you very, very much. All 1,600 plus of you. 5, 1,500 plus of you. I don't know how many you are. I love you very much. See you the next time.